Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Today I want to demonstrate you a tweet by Leandro Ferreira, which I do recommend to follow on Twitter because of his brilliant filament tips. And here's one of them. I want to demonstrate this code in a real project and discuss a little how it works. So if you want additional confirmation for your creating record form, here's what you can do. Imagine you have this form or whatever other form and you want to override the create button behavior to have confirmation. Then in the create page of your filament resource, you need to override the function get create form action. It should return the action from filament actions. Here's the use section on top. And then this is the code by Leandro. I just reproduced it. So you need to return the parent create form action. If we click that, this is the underlying function from filament vendor. But then on top, you override some of the stuff. You specify that submit should be null. And again, if we click inside, this is how submit works. If it's null and it can be null with this question mark, then can submit form becomes false. Then we add requires confirmation and we can do that with any action in filament. And then we override the action or add another action with two things close action model, which is the confirmation model window, and then create. Create record would be automatically called on this page of extends create record. So we're basically calling that manually. And then this is how it works. We fill something in, we click create, and then we have confirmation. We can click cancel, or if we click confirm, it actually saves the record. A few more things I wanted to point out if we click get create form action. This is one of the buttons of the form. The full form list is in get form actions. So in any create form, we have three buttons by default, create, create another and cancel. And this is the list. So get form actions returns an array and this is by default. So in the same fashion, you can override create form action, cancel form action, and also can create another can be disabled in the docs. You can find that there's create another false. And then also final thing, did you know that in create form action, there's key bindings to mod plus s, which on my Mac is command s. So for example, if I'm trying to fill in the form, instead of clicking create button or enter in some cases, I just can click command s and then the save automatically happens. Cool, right? I just discovered it myself while looking at the core code here. It's often really beneficial and fun to dive deeper into source code and find gems like this one kind of random tips, which I can share then on YouTube, on Twitter and elsewhere. So yeah, this is the original tip on Twitter by Leandro, expanded by myself with a few more tips here on YouTube. And I do recommend to follow Leandro on Twitter. I will link that original tweet in the description below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.